And, um, well, I can't help but notice. Don't pass me the torch. I'll light my own. Yeah, you lit a fire out there, brother, with that. Yeah, yeah it's fun out there. You couldn't really ask for much more. I mean, three to four, only four other guys having a good time. And then, you know, when you're talking about passing the torch, you know, going up against, like, you know, veteran competitors like Poncho Sullivan, just have to go out there and play your own game. Yeah, he's pretty much my favorite surfer. I love surfing on my surf at Sunset. had a pretty good heat, and, I mean, I'm just watching him surf. <laughs> yeah, you like those sponsor me deals, because because you finaled at Sunset as well, yeah? Yeah, actually, I had a really good one over there. The waves are firing six to eight feet, had a couple really good heats. And now you backed it up with a nice little... Uh, almost free surf-esque sesh out there on your backside out um, on it. So how how was it? It was good. It's fine. I mean, the waves are three to four feet. Couldn't really ask for much anything better. Got to thank Chris Carmichael. Not, nothing would be going on if it wasn't for him. Thank him and his family for putting this event on. Yeah, you've been kind of hanging with them a fair bit, haven't you? Yeah, Chris is a boss. He's a man hanging out with the family up in Dana Point and back over here at Diamond Head just on the program having a good time. Yeah, training at uh, Salt Creek, that must point, is uh, just like uh, bowls, yeah? Yeah, I'll hang with the Dana boys in Salt Creek. <laughs> yeah? No. Well, congratulations to you, my brother, Billy. You slash that one. We'll see you in the next round. Thank you. See you guys later.